Now, what are people starting to expect from the Winelands as an, as an overall tourism uh, destination? They want to be entertained. Mm. Do you know it's Saturday or Friday, you want to do something, where do you want to go? You're looking for entertainment. I think wineries are now, they're in the entertainment business. They're doing concerts now, they're doing all kinds of Food different events. Wine pairings, yeah. You can, yeah, so it's all about the packaging on mm -hmm. how to be entertained while drinking wine. Mm -hmm. So it's really getting that um, venue-ish experience that you can get in the city with the concerts and the food and the wine and taking it to a beautiful well, setting. Well, I think in the just we live in such hectic, fast-paced lives. I think mm -hmm. Take that natural, scenic beauty of the winelands mm -hmm. and throw in entertainment, you've got a great experience. Yeah. And, and that's, they're moving towards, well, we are in the entertainment industry. All right, now would you say that people don't really want to enjoy wine, create a wine experience in the comfort of their own home anymore? Would they rather take that outside and, and um, enjoy the winery, enjoy the scenery, be with the winemakers, be where the wine is made? Is that something that we're moving um, towards? Well, you can have both. Mm -hmm. That's actually what I meant to say. You could have that experience of going out, being entertained, but also that wine experience comes home with you. So when you are enjoying wine at home, you've got mm -hmm. memories around that brand, which makes you more brand loyal. That's mm -hmm. where, I think from a winery perspective and the investment of that, they're investing in their labels, mm -hmm. their, their brand of who they are, because they've created these brand homes with, they've created atmospherics around these brands. It's the lighting, it's the scenery, it's the offering, it's the staff. All of these things m make up a story around a wine. Now the Clink, level, yeah. the Clink Awards introduced the tracks and trails yes. category this year. Yeah. What's that all about? Basically it's about embracing new consumer trends that fitness and healthy lifestyle is very, very big business. And mm -hmm. also from a it seems weird to have health and fitness with wine and well, well, <laughs> health, wine, wine is good for you. Yeah, with wine. It has been proven that you can drink wine every mm. day, but with food. Yeah. So it's now to take the health benefits of being healthy, being outdoor, moving your body, and then rewarding yourself after that with mm -hmm. a glass of wine and some good delicious food lunch and, and amazing scenery. We really one thing about the South African winelands is it's very, very accessible. They're very well, I don't think there are any other wine regions in the world that you can experience without catching a plane and experience so many different terroirs. So mm -hmm. our unique selling point is our accessibility. You can experience so much in a small space. Yeah. And it's very, very diverse.